When it comes to performance cycling, whether it's long rides on Sunday mornings, road racing, or anything in between, bib shorts are where it's at for outright comfort. The pad provides a comfort so you can sit in the saddle for hours at a time, the straps avoid a waistband digging into your stomach, and there's no excess fabric to flap about. While there are other style of shorts available, like baggy, urban, or waist shorts, for any rides that combine distance and speed, bib shorts are hard to beat for comfort. You can wear them all year round too, under tights in the winter, and on their own in the summer. And if you're wondering, no, you don't wear under underwear underneath them. It's a common mistake, but they're designed to sit right next to the skin. Now in this video, we've delved into the vast RoadCC review archive to show you six really good bib shorts that we've tested and are happy to recommend. We're also covering a wide range of price points, so there's something for all tastes here. The DHB Aeron shorts are very good value for money with no compromises. And we highly recommend them if you want a pair of long lasting, tech packed bib shorts for training and racing in the warmer months. DHB has really made a name for itself with well-priced clothing, and these are its most technical shorts to date, the culmination of 10 years experience. And it really shows. These are well-designed with nice features, and best of all, they're very comfortable on the bike. The padded insert is thermo-molded and has a minimalist, flat design and a soft polyamide construction. It's big enough without feeling at all weighty or cumbersome. It's nice and dense too, so it won't lose its shape or degrade over time. The wide silicon grippers grip the legs nicely without squeezing them too much. And cold back technology really helps with cooling, and they also dry a lot quicker after wet rides. Most of the seams are flat lock stitched, except those that attach the straps to the shorts, but so far they've also been durable. Now in terms of price, they're a good value compared to bibs with a similar performance benefits. And in terms of performance and comfort, they're very impressive. These great value Calflux Chevron bib shorts from the new brand, available exclusive through Evan Cycles, offer good comfort levels married to a quality chamois. The elastic interface flux chamois is well up to the task of providing good comfort. It's a decent size and the covering of fabric is dual density, which helps collect and expel moisture. The high density foam is effective at eliminating road buzz and maximizing comfort. Although it's not graded in the same way that you find the likes of Castelli's excellent Progetto X2 air pad. Comfortable, high performing and well considered, their construction quality is very strong, despite feeling summer lightweight in bulk with all material turning well after a series of washes. Now throw in a competitive price and they're a really good option. These brand new bib shorts from Gorewear provide outstanding comfort, while a panel of windstopper fabric in the front of the shorts allow your down below a little extra protection from chilly cold winds. It's a strange idea, but it works well on brisk spring and early summer morning rides. The C5 Optiline Bib Shorts Plus are aimed at those warmer days, so to ensure a good breathability, they're made entirely from lightweight, meshy material that is thin and comfortable next to the skin. Flat lot stitching is used throughout, with seams strategically placed to ensure a good fit and prevent any potential irritation. Because no one wants irritation while on the bike for a long period of time. The fit is excellent, with perfect shape around the legs and hips, the material sitting flat next to the body in all areas. The wide elasticated hems spread the pressure around the legs while preventing slippage too. The advanced road pad uses various densities of foam to ensure there's more padding where you need it most and less where you don't. It's well executed, feeling comfortable on the saddle, whether cruising along in a sitting up position or perched on the nose when hunkered down in the drops. So all in all, they're very comfortable and ideal for warmer weather, but with a neat addition of the windstopper material in the front to keep out the chill. So it's kind of a bit of both worlds here. Now, if you're watching this, you're probably wondering what bib short is the best for long rides. Whether you just like riding all day or have some long distance sportives planned this summer, these Castelli Primo bib shorts are a really good pick. Castelli is keen to emphasize that these shorts are not for racing. They're for the hard miles you put in before you join the peloton. One of the key elements Castelli mentions is that rather than going for the minimalist look, it's added more to make these shorts much more suitable for those long rides. And to all in all, it works. The Primos are very comfortable to wear hours into the, in the saddle. And this is thanks to a lack of seams. The compression material used not only on the leg, but also on the lower back gives support. And the Progetto X2 seat pad, which as we've mentioned before, is used in many Castelli shorts. They are as comfortable as Castelli claim, you really forget you're wearing them. 
Of course, at this price, they're a substantial investment. But if you've been struggling with salon comfort or just want a really comfortable pair of shorts for long rides, be sure to check these Castelli bib shorts out. Sportful has a big presence in the professional peloton, sponsoring Piet Sagan's Bora team, so you know its products are going to be up to the demands of high-level bike riding. But they're priced to be competitive. These Giro shorts pack a lot of comfort into a bib that won't break the bank. These shorts are made of Sportful's usual excellent standards, and the fit is just as good as its more expensive products. The eight panel Elast X fabric construction with contrast flat lock stitching provides a nice fit around the legs and bum with no excess fabric to ripple in the wind or areas of tightness to detect. What you don't get here is a posh, all singing, all dancing padding insert in these shorts, but the updated Comfort Plus belies its simple appearance by providing excellent comfort. It does hold on to moisture a little longer than better ventilated inserts on warmer days, so that is something to keep in mind if you're going to buy these. Add in comfortable elastic leg bands and bib straps, good looks, a mesh bank panel, and you have a well-appointed bib short, ideal for any level of cyclist, from newbie all the way through to racer. For many, ASOS has long been first and last name in bib short comfort, but they've always commanded a high price. Well, until now, these milli shorts come in at £100 and are a seriously impressive choice. Yes, it's still a lot of money, but you get a lot of design and tech for that price. Now, key to the comfort of the shorts are the purple padded insert. It's one of the best on the market. It comprises eight millimeter thick memory foam with a waffle and perforated composition, providing a dimple surface to increase the breathability and increase comfort. And to increase that comfort further, the pad is only partially attached to the shorts, so it's free to move around with you. The chamois feels instantly comfortable the moment you pull the shorts on, even before you get on the saddle in a way that few other shorts manage. It's without doubt one of the most comfortable padded inserts our review has ever tested, providing superb seated comfort without much bulk at all. Add into that an excellent fit, wide flat bib straps, soft touch lycra with good support, but not overly compressive, wide hems with gripper tape, and you have a tip top bib short that's easy to recommend. Thanks for watching this video of six of the best bib shorts. As you can imagine, there's a lot of choice out there. So we hope that by giving you these six, that maybe it'll narrow down your choice. Like this video if you do in fact like it. Subscribe if you haven't already to Road CC for more videos like this every week. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you again next time.